In Guppy Grove this tale unfolds Of Gordon Grouper, fast and bold Oh what a mess, oh what a sight He gave the cleaner fish a fright But scrub away the dirt and mould For underneath a gentle soul If you like our Guppy Grove And want to dive into a treasure trove Then in the description down below Hit subscribe and away we go! Gordon the Grouper, Monster Magic by Teddy Snuggletail for Comfy Corner Time Listen very carefully. The question for this story is What famous nautical town was the fish wash in? Answers at the end Soon be there, not much further to go. A tired and grimy Gordon Grouper swam slowly into Guppy Grove. Seaweed hung off his face like a great big bushy beard. Barnacles peppered his body, covered in muck from months of swimming close to the ocean floor. He'd had a jolly old time. Exploring hidden crevices and forgotten caves, diving to deep dark depths. But the adventure had taken its toll and he was ready for a holiday. His appearance made him the subject of many whispers and wary looks. In the heart of Guppy Grove was a renowned one-stop wash shop for fish. A place where crusty, dirty marine creatures would come for a clean. These cleaner fish, known far and wide for their scrubbing skills, were the best in the business. Oh, how wonderful I'm going to feel after a good scrub, thought Gordon. He wanted to feel the gentle scrub of the cleaning fish see his scales shine like they once did. So he swam with determination towards the fish wash. However, when he arrived, the new young crew stared in shock. Mouths gaped open all around. They had never seen anything like it. Sea monster! squealed one, Panicking, they scattered in an instant, hiding behind corals and sea anemones. Gordon waited with patience, but the trembling cleaner fish refused to come out. Oh, said Gordon, and was about to leave when he caught the eye of Clarence, the wise old cleaner, who had been resting in the shadows. Hello, Gordon. Haven't seen you in a while. Would say it shows if I weren't so polite, he commented. Bobbing lazily in the shade, the seasoned veterans watched on. They had seen all kinds of sea creatures, and it took more than Gordon to frighten them. Clarence and his friends swam out to Gordon and began their work without hesitation. Tell us all about your adventures, they asked. Gordon was only too pleased to entertain them. Oh, what a wonderful time they had. The younger cleaner fish watched in disbelief as the old masters worked their magic. They scrubbed, they picked and they polished. They even giggled and laughed. As the layers of grime and barnacles fell away, a stunning transformation unfolded. Gordon was not a monster after all. Layer by layer the dirt lifted, revealing a magnificent creature. A rainbow of colours shimmered off his dazzling scales. He warmed the hearts of everyone with his soft gentle smile eyes sparkling with joy he said oh how good it is to be clean 
With hesitation and caution, the younger fish emerged from their hiding spots. Ashamed of their initial fear and judgment, they apologised to Gordon. Oh, that's okay, young scamps, laughed a hearty Gordon. I did look a sight, didn't I? Inspired by the old masters, they joined in the final touches of Gordon's makeover. From that day on, the fish wash was a place of no judgment, where every sea creature, no matter how grimy or rugged, was welcomed with open fins. Gordon made an effort to visit more often, if only to tell the youngsters tales of adventure. Never judge a book by its cover. It's what's underneath that truly counts. Have you been listening carefully? Do you know what the famous nautical town is? Yes, that's right. Guppy Grove. Well done. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.